So how did you get into football? Um, I started when I was like four years old. My brother and sister are big footballers. My whole family's football based, so that was all we really knew. Who was your first footballing idol? Um, my first footballing idol was probably, well it's a throw up, it's either Ronaldinho or Thierry Henry. What was the name of your first football club? Durham Town. Are there any big sacrifices you've had to make to get you to the stage you're at now? Yeah, quite a few. I think um, the biggest one, I know it's quick, but the biggest one would just be my, my childhood really. Kind of that got sacrificed to be, you know, training all the time and be in the position I'm in. What's been your best memory in football to date? Um, that's a good question. Um, again, it's a bit of a toss up between winning the championship title quite convincingly or beating Man City at home, who were the champions at the time, so between them two. What was the first pair of boots you owned? They were Puma Kings. And what boots do you wear now? I wear Puma Futures now. What's the best goal you've ever scored? Um, probably be uh, against Arsenal at home. Arsenal at home. Is there any one bit of advice you were given as a kid that you've always hung on to? Yeah. Um, well, the, the main one I would say really would be uh, hard work beats talent if talent doesn't work hard. How would your teachers have described you? Probably a little bit cheeky. And what would your teachers say about you now? I think they'd be proud, yeah. I think they'd be proud. What would you be if you weren't a professional footballer? So that, is, that is the question, isn't it? That is the million dollar one, because no one has the answer for that. Um, I'd like to think I'd do something else in sport, obviously dependent or saying that I didn't have any ability in football. I'd, I think I'd do something else sport, yeah. Messi or Ronaldo? Messi. Playing at home or playing away? Playing at home. Thank you.